good variety of people, good personalities. The opportunities that they give us in the trips and trips and things, yeah, we've had a lot of like trips abroad and stuff like that. Best moment I've been here. Ooh. There's been many best moments. <laughs> Too many. I wouldn't know where to begin to be honest. Yeah. No? Yeah. Okay. What was it like with the seven? It's a bit scary. It's a little bit nerve-wracking. bit nerve-wracking. At first, very nervous. I felt quite nervous because it was bigger than the primary school. Quite nervous at the beginning because I didn't really know anybody. Um, a bit nervous. A bit worried because I feel like it's bigger than the school that we last went to. Every year seven is slightly different from the year before. It's just nice. You, you get, you know, you come to work and you pick up the enthusiasm and the um, and the energy, and, and that sort of helps keep me young at my advanced age as well. So. We're setting an example for the younger kids, so. But some of them scare me. Like, <laughs> they're taller than me. <laughs> yeah, they're taller than me. <laughs> excited when you see year six starting. It's that sense of hopefulness and optimism about the future. It's nice and it's like different than primary so yeah. In our year group everyone quite likes each other, we all get along, everyone gets along and mixes around. They do don't they? What usually happens is the children are really excited about starting and it's their mums and dads are all nervous and anxious. Students need to have a broad and balanced education. English and maths, of course, history and geography. I choose geography because it's something interesting to learn. Um, science, that always causes lots of uh, excitement. So what do you like about science? Experiments, experiments. and taking part. Yeah. What do you like about art? The fact we have freedom to do what we like and express ourselves in lots of different ways. Got any lessons that you're looking forward to doing? Um, PA. There's a lot of variety in the sports that we do and this very the teachers make it very fun and enjoyable. Education's not just about subjects that you study and the exams that you get, it's a broader than that. All the opportunities you get. All the opportunities you get to do. The opportunities that they give us. The wide range of facilities such as the sports facilities, the music and the art department, we've got a we can do anything we want really, take it wherever we want to. So many opportunities. It's really fantastic. Makes me very jealous of them. <laughs> I see um, students being very nice, very like liking their teachers and enjoying the lessons. Good teachers, it's just like good subjects to learn. Teachers make it very fun. With all the tutors and with all staff, you know, we're really great at communicating. Sort of at the start of the year, lots of year sevens are wonderfully enthusiastic about things and sort of really love getting into things, getting into their teaching. Are you excited about the next five years then? Yes. Yeah. 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 Very much. I think it took me quite a while to get used to it, but now I'm used to it, it's great. No, 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 are you no, feeling no. excited? Yeah. Yeah. I'm a happy puppy. Are you not nervous? No. No? no? Very excited. Yeah. Much better than primary school. Yeah. Our sixth formers do have a, a really wide range of choices. Geography. English literature. History. French. Media studies. Graphics. Maths. Theatre studies. ICT. Psychology. Business studies. I think we are an excellent sixth form. We are very caring. Um, we try and nurture our students on to success in future life. Most least favourite thing about sixth form? Favourite thing about sixth form? You can like me. Loads of people, like, I mean, friendship groups change from middle school and stuff. Probably the teachers. My subjects. And least, um, 
the workload. It's a big workload, but I think it's worth it at the end of the day. I think they very much enjoy the relationship uh, that they establish with their subject staff, their, their tutors, and their admin support team. Are your relationship with your teachers good? Really good. Very good. They appreciate the sense of independence and responsibility that they're given. More freedom than lower school? Yeah. Yeah, because you have free periods. Yes. Six form experience in one word. Brilliant. Interesting. <laughs> Is such a buzz working with these very fine young adults who come into the school. They're such fun to work with. Funniest moment. One of the funniest, or the most embarrassing, certainly, was the year that I um, I said I would take part in the Year Eight uh, pantomime for Year Eight that the tutors were doing, and I was the good fairy, and I had to enter from stage right on um, a, a scooter and I'd never had a go on a scooter before and I thought how hard can this be and I started on the scooter and what I hadn't checked out was how to stop the scooter and I literally flew across the front of the hall and all I could see was the plate glass window coming up closer and I had to, my only way that I could do an emergency stop was to jump off the scooter and of course I fell over and, and then I had to pretend it was all part of the performance. Uh, well this is something that happened only, um, only this year with a year 13 student um, she comes into the office and says, Sir, uh, can I take a picture of you? I said, Why? Oh, it's for my arts project. Okay. What's the theme of your art project? She said, Old people. Oh, fantastic, I say to her. Oh, great, that makes me feel so much better. Um, have you not got any grannies that you could go to? Oh, well, I went to um, a 65th birthday party recently, but they weren't old enough. Oh, fantastic, I say to her. Well done. So I'm now the oldest person you know. She said, uh, yeah. It is that kind of engagement, that kind of interaction with students that just makes this job so special.